3ds Max is one of those 3D modeling softwares that provides a huge number of plugins and scripts to its users. So in this video, I'm going to talk about top 10 best 3ds Max scripts that I use in my daily basis to improve my 3D modeling skills. So let us go and check out the first script. Let us see the first script, which is known as border fill. To install the script, just drag and drop the script to the 3ds Max viewport and then go to customize, customize user interface from there. In the category, you will find PolyOP. Now create a new toolbar and name it whatever you like and drag and drop this toolbar like that and drop your PolyOP to the toolbar. Now let us see how this script works. You need to just select two corner vertices like this and just you need to press on border fill. You can see that the script is doing the work for you. And also you can see that we can play around and select different vertices and we are going to get different results all the time. This is one of the best script when I'm working in 3ds Max to fill out the open borders without doing it manually. Let us go to the second script, which is known as drag and drop reference images. Reference images plays a crucial part when you are doing 3D modeling. So you need a perfect reference images to create perfect looking 3D models. Drag and drop reference images is actually one of the best script to have, which helps you to place your reference images inside 3ds Max viewport without doing it manually. With just one click, you are going to place your reference images with the perfect dimensions all set up ready to go for doing your 3D modeling. So drag and drop reference images is a must have script for everyone who are trying to use reference images for doing their 3D modeling. Script number three, VU MCG rope. Go to scripting and then from there we are going to install max creation graph and from there we are going to go for selecting our script. In my case, this is on the desktop. So click on the script and press on install and that will install the script. So let us see how this script works. So this script works by selecting a cylinder and then we are going to apply the modifier. So we are going to go to the modifier list and we are going to select VU MCG rope modifier and that will apply the script to the cylinder. After that, we, we can see that we are getting some parameters to play around. You can always go back to the cylinder and increase the height radius and we can increase the poly count to make the rope look more realistic. This script also works great with part deformer modifier. So you can use part deformer modifier to create complex looking ropes that we want in our project. If you ever had problems creating ropes in 3ds Max, this is one of the best script for creating complex looking rope. Script number four, uni attach and uni detach. To install this script, just drag and drop this script to your 3ds Max viewport. And from there, you need to go to customize, customize user interface. From here in the category, you will find nicklet scripts. From here, you just drag and drop uni attach and uni detach script to your toolbar. So once you have done that, we can use these two buttons to attach a group of object or detach a group of object very easily by just pressing one click. If you ever have used Autodesk Maya, we know that we can drag, select a group of object and detach them all at once. But in 3ds Max, we don't have that type of functionality. But thanks to this script, now we can. Script number five, sofa strict. The next script is for them who like to create chest field sofas or chest field patterns. This script helps user to create wrinkles in the chest field patterns very easily. The script is very easy to use. We have profile button and the depth button. And you can see two graphs. Select the edges that you need to create wrinkles and then press profile. The profile option will help to create a profile around the edges. After that, press the depth button which will add depth to the edges. In the top, we have depth multiplier, which will give a certain number of depth amount according to the user's input. And once you have done that, you can see that we are getting a really nice looking wrinkles in the chest fill pattern. I would highly recommend everyone to check out this script, which will help you finish your chest filled model. Script number six, vertex cleaner. To install this script, just drag and drop this script to the 3ds Max viewport and go to customize, customize user interface. And from there, you are going to select Shiva tools. And from there, you can see that we are having vertex cleaner. Drag and drop this to your toolbar. Now this script is very useful when you are doing operations like booleans. So what this script does is it cleans out the unwanted vertices left over after you are doing any boolean operations. This script is very handy and very powerful. I recommend this script for anyone who is doing complex 3D models. This is one of my favorite script because it not only helps in creating good topology, but further it is going to help you in your UVs and texturing. 
script number seven bj quantify all this script is very useful when you have n gons in your 3d model bj quantify all as the name says it will turn your n gons into quads so that you will not be having any problem while you export your 3d model i recommend this script to all those artists who want a fast fix for their n gons by no means this is the best method to fix your n gons but if you really want a quick little fix for your n gons I would go for this script. Script number eight, hard edges. To use this script, just drag and drop the script to your viewport and go to your edge selection mode. And this will automatically select those hard edges for you so you can bevel them. I use this script tons of time when I'm doing any hard surface modeling. This script is very useful when you want to select your hard edges and bevel them out without doing it manually. Just select the model, just drag and drop the script to the 3ds Max viewport and go to the edge selection mode and boom, you'll be having your edge selected automatically. Script 9, Replace Object Script. To install this script, just drag and drop this script to the 3ds Max viewport. This script is very useful when you want to replace a certain number of objects with a particular object that you want to be replaced to. In this script, you have two options. The one is old object and the other one is new object. Select the old object from which you want to be replaced and then select the new object that is going to be replaced by and just press the replace button and that will replace the old object with the new object. And last but not the least, script number 10, UniConnect. Let us install the script by dragging and dropping the script to the 3ds Max V port. And we are going to go to customize, customize user interface. In the Nicklet script category, you will be having the script. Just drag and drop the script in the toolbar. UniConnect has the capability to connect vertices from any direction, which is really awesome. When you're doing complex 3D models, this little script is going to be very handy for you. We can also connect multiple open vertices in seconds by using this script. This script is also having a bridge operation capability and overall UniConnect is a must have script for all hard surface modeling artists. Hey guys, this is Dave from CG Dave Animation. Before you guys leave, I just have a small message for you guys that if the video was really helpful, then please go ahead and give a like and also do subscribe to our channel. So till then, stay creative and keep learning.